Ahoy gamers! It's gaming time! I just spent um, the better part of four minutes doing the last puzzle that I have already done before. How about that? Anyway, now that I've done that, uh, I don't actually know if I've what all I've done now. Fun! How about that? Um, isn't this the part that I got stuck on? I get the feeling that the answer is yes. But only because, um, yes, it absolutely... What the hell? At least let me play the game, game. Like, please? PLEASE? YOU'RE SHITTING ME?! Let me close my door real quick. I'm not editing this out, by the way. Y'all can deal with the pause screen really quick. This game, I don't know why I'm still playing it. Well, I, I know exactly why I'm still playing it. I kind of want to know what happened to Fred, just a little bit. Not enough, not not really the, to the amount that they want us to care about um, Uncle Fred. Oh, that's where I'm supposed to go. I'm so glad that that was so immediately apparent. Wow, thank God that they had the literal, you do a running and jumping indicator um, right there. How about that? God, this game is good. That was a bad, wasn't it? Anyway. Hey, look. Now I can actually reach this, huh? Right? 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 And they put me back up here. Why wouldn't they? Why wouldn't that be the case? You know, why wouldn't you just do that to me? Do I go further down? Is this what you want, game? Is there yet another platform down here? No, and I just walked off like a dumbass. Fun, 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 fun. Yeah, um, let's see. Let's have a rundown of what has happened today. Uh, I finished streaming Into the Gun, which is another game that I suck ass at. And I started playing this, and I just walk off edges because the game doesn't let me jump. Wonderful. This is going to be the whole episode, by the way. Um, I'm probably not even lying to you there. This is probably actually just going to be the whole damn thing. Um, why wouldn't it be, you know? What else is there to do? What else can I do? What possible? What am I missing here? And I just walked the heck off again, because it's ice. It's ice. Alright. Okay, let's try this again. Let's try the whole shebang a fifth time. Thank you. Come on. Come on. Cool. Nice. There's nothing I can fucking do here. Very cool. Very nice. Great game design, I gotta say. Everything is so obvious on what exactly I need to do. And... Um... Uh... My sarcasm is transparent. Is it over there? I can't see. I have no idea what... Oh, that's why! You literally just fall through at the tip. Wonderful. That's so great. I'm... I'm, I'm amazed at the... the validity with which this game was created. What can I tether to? Um, nothing within reach, evidently. Oh, cool, the crystals come back. I didn't know that. We learned something new today, boys. And we also learned something old. This game sucks. Anyway. Let's try... Uh, yeah, nothing. I can't reach anything. Nothing was within reach. Forgot that you can't move when you're in, like, this state. That should be... You should be able to reach that. By all metrics, within this game, you should be able to reach that. You... It's pretty consistent with your ability to reach things. 
I am not where I should be. You know, maybe if I jump from here, like, uh, like this, I'll be able to reach it. Come on. Yes? Okay, that's what we'll do then. Wonderfully made game, though. Jesus Christ. Very cool, thank you, Kanye. I'm so glad that I have to literally jump from an area that is blocked off or supposed to be. Looks that way. Looks like it's not supposed to be available. Oh, you know what? That was probably I was probably supposed to force the rocket boots if I'm being honest. Please? Why does that fucking happen? <laughs> Literally, the ability to reel in doesn't even benefit you the entire game, unless you're trying to hit a specific piece of rock on the ground. Even then, it's like not, it's extremely finicky. It's not very beneficial. Shoot. Okay, very nice. Very nice, I've done it. Ladies and gentlemen, we did it. And now we do this, right? Because I have to freaking... Please don't hit my head. <laughs> hey, at least me spawns me right here instead of that other portion. really weird in the walkie the way that the controls work sometimes well not like the controls as much as just like the way the game works okay I don't care oh wonderful Probably freeze to death. I had no other choice than to press. Oh, wonderful. Now that. <laughs> oh, cool. Blind jumps. Nothing better than blind jumps. Yeah, totally. All right. Come on, come on, come on. Alright, here's where I'm supposed to land. Right here. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful stuff. Um, I am willing to end it here. Very willing. Ever so willing to end it right here. I'm, I really like how, um... The game literally just gave me something new and then said, actually, no, you're not allowed to use that the rest of the game. Uh, that's not what games do normally. It's generally kind of a, a kind of rule of thumb of gaming that uh, you get something new and kind of keep it. I would have thought, I mean, I could be wrong, correct me if I'm wrong, but generally when you get a power-up in a game, you keep it. At least something functional like that that'll help you on puzzles, not puzzles, but where the heck do I go from here? How do I know? Where do I go from here? Okay, that answers that question. I do kind of like how um, this is basically not a tether puzzle at all. The tether you can use if you want to, but you don't have to. I like that. I do really like that I can just kind of jump and walk and things like that, and it's not a swinging puzzle like the entire rest of the game is, because the swinging puzzles, they're not even puzzles, it's just platforming. When am I gonna, when am I gonna learn? <laughs> oh, I see. We can dance if we want to. 
leave your friends behind. And if they don't dance, then there ain't no friends of mine. We can dance, we can dance. Everybody pull off your pants. I'm never speaking again. <laughs> anyway. Bruh, DK64 vibes, except the controls are admittedly much better. Granted, the game is comparatively somewhat worse. Not really. No, there's not. I appreciate the graphics more in DK64. <laughs> ah, let's see. Can I jump up to this? It's sometimes a bit amazing how far, how high you can jump. Like, I don't expect it all the time. Yeah, I think I'll finish this one. I, I'm, I'm, I'm beginning to like this just because of how it is. It's an, again, it's not a tether puzzle. It's not a puzzle. They're puzzle. It's not tether platforming. The way that the tether works in this game is not the best. Oh god. I'm hoping they don't actually want me to do what I think they want me to do. No, they don't. And I just kind of bit the dust there. And I fell. Again. Let's just kind of like stop for a moment and appreciate that I can fall at anything. Wonderful. Wonderful stuff. The fact that you can just kind of walk off edges. I um, guess that's a typical thing in 3D platformers, the ability to walk off of an edge. At the same time, I don't much appreciate that I will consistently walk off of edges now that I've already beaten the puzzle already, basically. It's not a puzzle, it's platforming. Why do I say puzzling? It's not a puzzle, it's platforming. <laughs> Maybe it's Maybelline. Anyway. I see, this is what I must do. Oh my gosh, I was about to slip off of that. Let me charge. There we go. Oh, God. Anyway. <laughs> On the next episode of a story about my uncle. You know what? I, let's just walk along here because I know it's going to... I know it's gonna it's gonna spit me out somewhere I don't want it to if I end up now. If I end the episode now it's gonna it's gonna spit me back to like the very beginning of this cave or something. I wouldn't doubt it. I kind of doubt it just a little bit, but not and not enough that I'll trust this game to actually end it here. Let's God, wouldn't it be cool if you could save game? Whoa, dude. How could Fred leave stuff behind everywhere? How much was he carrying? As I remember it, Fred wasn't that good at keeping track of all his things. Like you. Hey, it's not like you're any better. Sorry. Anyway, Fred counted on losing a few things on each of his journeys. He always brought more stuff than he needed. For a paddling trip we had, he brought so many life jackets, we could barely fit ourselves in the canoes. Isn't it hard to lose track of a life jacket if you're wearing it? <laughs> Good point. I guess he didn't really think of that. Well, how about that? Anyway, on the next episode of A Story About My Uncle, we will unravel more of the story about his uncle, because why wouldn't we do that? Like, comment, and subscribe, or you can end up in ice cave and freeze to death. Bra moment. Goodbye.
Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.